All right, Dan Claskins here, our uh, TriStateFootball.com, Fox 19, U.S. Marine Backyard Battle, Campbell County Ryle, the Camels, pulling off the big road win tonight. Head coach Stephen Lickard, his team lays claim to the district title. And coach, uh, I'll be the first to admit, our site didn't have you guys in it. I don't think anybody had you guys in this district race, and it certainly looked like a few weeks ago at 0-5, your team wasn't going to be a factor, but a win over Simon Kenton. You totally took it to Dixie Heights last week, and now the big win here at Riles, the icing on the cake. Talk to us. Uh, I mean, the move to quarterback of Tyler Durham was one thing, but just overall, the last few weeks, you know, what what start clicking for you guys that, uh, you know, wasn't working as well early in the season? Our, our kids are the greatest kids you can find, and they just came together as a team, and even when we were 0-5, you know, we kept showing to them, look, we can do this, you know, this is, we, we fix this mistake, we fix that mistake, we're going to be okay and just believe and went back to the basics during the bye week and and man our kids are just they're just obsessed with proving people wrong yeah they've definitely uh, have done that over the past couple weeks uh, let's talk a little bit about Tyler Durham I mean you shifted him to the quarterback position a few weeks ago uh, tonight he scores three of your team's four touchdowns. I mean, Ryle had no answers for him. What's his play meant to uh, provide and spark into the offense? Uh, he's a special kid. He's a special player, but he's got a great offensive line in front of him that's opening up some nice holes. But really, he, he's a kid that can score at any moment in time. And when you have a kid like that that touches the ball first on every play, you're in pretty good shape. But I think Tyler would tell you just as much as anybody else that that offensive line in front of him is really opening up holes for him. And, and he gets those tough yards, those tough second yards, but he hits the hole and he's just a great football player. Let's talk a little bit about this game, Coach. You guys, uh, four turnovers in the first half, couldn't find the end zone, uh, down 13 to nothing at halftime. What did you tell the kids in the locker room? Uh, you know, and what adjustments were made heading into the second half. We told our kids that we just played the worst half of football against the best team in our district, and it's only 13 to nothing. And uh, and and our kids kind of lit up. You're right. You know, we played terrible, and uh, and we just made some adjustments to spread them out a little more. Went away from our double tight stuff that they were because they were defending it very well. They had a great game plan, and uh, we just figured we would spread the field out and make them move out of the box. And and Tyler was able to find some creases in our offensive line, and our defense were able to get some stops it was just a great team yeah, effort great team effort let's talk a little just quickly about the defense I mean Harmon he, he was all over the ball you guys had some turnovers of your own Walsh with the big pick there uh, I mean what about that unit do you, and, and just in the team in general this has to get better if you guys are going to keep this momentum riding into with playoffs. Just a we couple weeks we away. can't be happy with 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 winning. You know, we have to make sure every week it's the same thing. And we guarded we guarded so much this past week, telling our kids 50 points aren't just going to appear on the board. You know, we're going to have to go play every down, and we're going to have to earn the respect of our the rest of our district. And Ryle is the bar, and they're the standard, and and they're where we want to be. And we just focused and told our kids, you know, we can't get too happy. You can never get too high, can never get too low in this game. you got to stay even all the time, and they've really bought it. Yeah, you guys hand Ryle just their fifth loss here at home on senior night. A great job, the Campbell County Camels. When's the last time you guys won a district uh, title? Somebody it's, told me 31 years ago. 31 years. I was like, I didn't think I could remember. Well, Coach, congratulations. Best of luck to you the rest of the season. Great job here in your number one. Thanks. Stephen Lickard, Campbell County High School. Thanks, Dan.